that there's so many things you can do even from a lifestyle standpoint with your diet to help boost your immune system. Yes. And sometimes that's something that's not really talked about with cancer right. patients. Were there things that you did with your diet to, oh, yeah. to help boost your immune system? To oh, absolutely. Um, the there cancer? was many things. Um, that, that was the very first thing I started researching is what can I do to build my immune system, give myself a fighting chance? Mm -hmm. And there's so many things out there to really boost your immune system. One that I just not too fond of was <laughs> wheatgrass. Some of wheat them don't taste very good. Uh, <laughs> so painful was wheatgrass, mm -hmm. and you know it it has. Yum. It's got yeah. great properties. It's, you but it's get funny. used to it, though. Yeah, you do I'm, get used to it. Yeah, yeah. and it's funny because I met people that loved wheatgrass. I'm like, how is that possible? You know? But it really did make a difference, and it does build your immune system. And what I found, even taking wheatgrass, is I watched tumors shrinking just by doing the wheatgrass alone. Mm -hmm. So That's there's, awesome. you know, there is many things to do. But I think it's really important to educate yourself because it's not just one thing. Yeah. Sure. You know, it's a, it's a combination of things. It's really staying away from things like sugar and mm -hmm. processed foods mm -hmm. and artificial flavors yeah, yeah. and all that and really take your, your life back.